And so there are many things that still are not known in the field of cannabis. The plant produces a group of compounds uh, called cannabinoid acids. The acids were not investigated until recently, not very thoroughly at least, because they're not stable, they break down. The medical industry, the major medical industry, want to have pure compounds that have been investigated. They have been thoroughly tested. So a few years ago, uh, we decided to go ahead and try to stabilize these acids and we were able chemically to stabilize them. And now it is possible to investigate them. Companies that I work with, EPM, works on the acids of the cannabinoids. We're looking into the activities of these acids and they seem to be important, very important uh, uh, in a variety of fields. So chances are that uh, here we have something and uh, of considerable medical importance. And I'm sure that there will be ways to introduce these compounds as medical agents. Uh, collaboration is absolutely a necessity. Yes, there is a meeting now of uh, CANMED and EPM together, and it's going to take place in Pasadena, and I'm going to fly there, try to give a general picture of what we've been doing and what I hope will be done in the future. I expect to show that cannabis and cannabinoids are not a tiny project, one compound for one disease, but to show that it is a, really a very, very wide field of research. We need good new drugs in a huge number of fields. It's an open field for new drugs, new preparations, and I believe that there will be a lot of work in this field over the next decade or so, maybe two decades.